What's up guys, Bloodshed here. Today we're talking about how to make gold with cooking in World of Warcraft Legion. We're gonna cover like bacon, we're gonna cover feasts and food and all kinds of things. Now, first things first. So this video is basically because we're getting raids in like two weeks, guys. So no one's thinking about like the best food in the game right now, except for golds like us. One thing we do know is that individual food is more powerful than the feast that you can make. So most people are going to be buying food individually for themselves if you want to be, you know, the best DPS you can be. If you want to be number one on the charts, you're going to want to buy specific food, right? And they're going to buy the food from us, hopefully. So one thing I would suggest is getting the materials for um, a bunch of different types of uh, level three food, right? So to do this, we're going to have to obviously stockpile materials, start farming a little bit now. I wouldn't... I wouldn't totally divert from our normal farming that we're doing because gold is really good right now, right? But I would probably start spending maybe 20% of my time on farming food for Legion because there's going to be another big boom, just like there was a big boom with armor sales and, you know, ore and things like that very early on. I wouldn't craft a bunch of food individually necessarily because we don't know what's going to be big, you know, and every server is different. Haste might do really well on my server but on your server critical strike food might do really well so you kind of want to just have the materials ready and you want to re react to the market so i'd probably make two or three stacks of each type of food a few days before the raid comes out and throw them on the auction house and see where the market takes me and then kind of go off of that prepare my friends the lunch rush is coming so farm materials unlock the recipes with Nomi, your little chef in your faction cooking area. To do this, you obviously want to get a bunch of different types of cooking reagents and you want to research, right? So this takes a while. Like you, you, you can hold up to like 24 work orders or 20 to 24 work orders at a time. And you know, you learn recipes, majority of the recipes that way. So I would kind of start to get the work orders rolling in. That way you're ready for the lunch rush, so to speak. Now, it doesn't mean that feasts are garbage. I would still make feasts, right? So the actual feasts are used by engineers. They need five for their quest. So I would always pretty much for the duration of the expansion keep like, you know, maybe four stacks of five on the auction house just for those potential engineer sales. Other than that, um, you can make the bigger feasts and put them up there. I'm sure people love them for dungeons, you know. They like to feel appreciated when you go into a dungeon and someone drops a feast down. All right, let's talk about bacon, okay? You can make lots of money in bacon. If you're watching this and you're like, I don't really want to be a cook bloodshed, you can do the daily quest for bacon, okay? You can do this on all your alts. So ideally, you'd have a bunch of alts and you would farm bacon. Now, why would we do this? Bacon is selling on my server for 50 gold a pop. It's a world quest only. So you can only get this through world quests from what I'm understanding. So at 10 stacks, that's a 500 gold quest. That's super quick to do. You literally just go to the world quest, kill an easy animal, and he drops 10 stacks, uh, or not 10 stacks, 10 items of bacon. And right now they're flipping for 50 gold a piece on my server. So it's insane. It's like a go pick up 500 gold and you know, that's it. So this is kind of like the rare crafting material for cooking in Legion. This is kind of what bottlenecks us, I guess, because um, it is used in some of the higher end recipes, bacon. Um, you can make bacon into crispy bacon and it extends your food buffs by an hour. So if you're not dying, if your raid is full G code, or if you are questing or leveling up a character and you want to keep your big food buff, you can just eat some crispy bacon and you can extend that same food up to six hours, right? So that's something to know. Um, so you're not going to see bacon unless you look up at the world quests and every day you're going to be able to find it. All right, my friends, fishing. Fishing is a huge part of Legion. Fish have been selling like crazy. Fish have been selling so well. Um, a lot of people need them for various things. Um, they're expensive. I think a big part of the fishing phenomenon is, yeah, they're gonna hold their value. Yes, they're definitely important, probably more than any other expansion. But the big thing is, is like nobody's fishing right now. Everyone is like obsessed with their eye level and they're constantly gearing and, you know, pushing their character to the limit, getting ready for raids and, they want to be like, you know, mythic bosses and things like that, PvP pros. Like nobody's really, you know, wants to sit there and fish when we have an expansion. The very few people, maybe the gold sellers, maybe the enthusiasts, 
um, are pretty much the only ones that are into the fishing at the moment. Um, but, but you can actually make money with fishing um, and you can actually use that in cooking. So you can make lots of great recipes with fish and sell them. So fishing is another thing. I would stock up on all materials, but don't sleep on fishing. I know this is a cooking video, but it's fishing and cooking kind of go together. And um, yeah, if, if anything, I would go to the auction house, purchase the fish you don't have, purchase a few stacks of fish you don't have. That way you can research them and unlock the recipes with Nami just so you can be ready for when the, you know we get our you know our huge lunch rush coming in happy hour you know what i'm saying all right guys it's time for the bloodshed to depart if you want to watch any of my other videos i'll put them up here on the screen again i appreciate the support you guys give me every time you like my video it makes me super happy makes me want to work harder i appreciate all you patreon bros supporting my content and what i do again this is the bubble 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 bloodshed and i'm out of here peace